Hi boys and girls, welcome to our day two video of our habitat writing. So yesterday we wrote our introduction sentence and our first reason and example. Make sure that you have this completed before moving into your second reason and example. If you do not have this completed, you need to go back to Tuesday and complete this assignment. Um, so for today, um, I'm going to continue talking about the habitat that I chose, which is the ocean. And remember, if you chose something different, that is totally fine. Um, I'm going to continue writing by doing my second reason and example for today. So I'm going to continue. And remember, for my second one, I can use the transition word next, comma. And I need to do something different. In my first reason, I had talked about how um, I like the animals. So now I need to think of something that's different than animals. I don't want to be repeating myself. So I need something different. So next, I think the ocean is a very oops, pretty um, place because of the water. Or maybe I'm just really thinking of how it looks. I like that it has a lot of water. And then I can do another transition word to show my reason. Um, and you can keep using the transition word, for example, or you could try a new one like for instance. For instance, the coral reefs. Let me just move that down a little bit. For instance, the coral reefs have many, ooh, you know, now that I'm thinking through my thought here, boys and girls, I was about to start talking about the fish. And now that I think about it, fish is animals. So it's almost like I'm repeating myself again. So you know what? I'm just going to delete this. I'm going to start my thought process over because I was about to repeat myself by talking about more animals. So I might talk about the water again because I, up here in my reason, I had talked about the water. So that's something I should talk about. So for instance, um, I have gone to the beach and swam in the water and it was cool and very clear. I could be very deep down into the water. I'm going to say into the ocean. You could see very deep into the ocean. So I added two sentences here. You know, you don't have to add two sentences. For me, I felt like my reason needed just a little extra support. So I added a little more support. So for instance, I have gone to the beach and swam in the water and it was cool and very clear. I could see very deep down into the ocean. Now, you, like I said, you don't have to add this next sentence if you don't want to. I chose to just to keep supporting my reason here. Um, so that's, again, something that you can do if you'd like to. But remember, you don't have to. You do, however, have to have your reason. So that is one sentence and your example, which is the second sentence. So make sure that you have that so far. Um, and Again, with your uh, assignment for today, you should have yesterday's assignment of your introduction, your first reason, your first example. Then today's assignment, you need to have your second reason and your second example. Please make sure that you have this completed before um, doing tomorrow's assignment. Uh, I really want you guys to practice writing a structured paragraph. That's why these videos are so important important so make sure that you are watching and you are learning and it's okay to re-watch if you need to um, these videos are here to help and support you if you have any further questions you can reach out to your teacher and your teacher is more than happy to help you have a wonderful wednesday and i'll see you guys soon